good morning welcome back to my channel this is tanya side so crafts and i have a haul for you today what <laughs> feel like i've been uh, hauling a lot lately with my thrift stores and and friend splurges and all the goodies that we've been um bringing in i gotta get more stuff out before i bring more stuff in right well we're not gonna play like that today. We're gonna bring, we don't need any negativity. Let's look at the good things I got. So I have not opened this yet. And honestly, I can't remember what I bought. This is from scrapbook.com. And I believe I was shopping in the clearance section. Oh, except for that paper right there. <laughs> so um, let me pull this up and we'll go through it together. I'm so excited. I've been waiting for this box. It was supposed to be here yesterday and I got a an alert that it was late and I was really disappointed. So, you may have heard me talking about my daughter Chloe, this amazing girl. She went into my office and found my Market Square paper and loved it. So I actually went and bought another pack. I'll probably buy still another one because I love it so much, but this one's gonna be hers. So I got that for Chloe. So she can make whatever she wants out of it. So I did get some feedback. It's like, hey, just let her have it. It's paper. I get it. I get it. But let me get her her own. <laughs> she can make what she wants. So I got some more papers. These were loose ones. And I think I got some of these. Oh, God, I keep hitting that camera. I am so sorry. Some of these because she inspires me. So I think I got some of these for her, too. Look at the camera and the journals and the glasses and all the fun things on here. A cell phone, I didn't even see that, that's cute. So I got that one, there's some lipstick. And these are Halloween tags. Can't, can't see it very well, but there's like different lines and stuff to cut the tags, those are super cute. Oh, but they're on this side too. Those are fun. Fun, fun, fun. And then I got some tags for the um, the market square. I'll share this one with her if I don't already have it, but I might keep that one or split it with her. I don't know. I don't know. And then this one, isn't that cute? Look at that. I needed some Halloween stuff. And then this one was one of both of our favorite papers. I think she used this one, so I replaced it. And then she used this one too, so I replaced that one for my pack because I haven't even opened my pack yet. So she was in there pulling stuff out. I'm like, wait. <laughs> so I was trying to replace it with some of the some of the favorites. This one's really cool. It's got all the vegetables on one side, and then on this side it's got all the cameras, so it hits home for both of us. I love that. And then the strawberries, we both love that one. I can't remember if I gave in and gave her that one or not, but I got another. And she loved this one too, just as I did. And I think that I wouldn't let her have that one. I think I kept that one. And then I absolutely love the animals. That's on the other side, ledger paper. And then flowers, so pretty. So yeah, I got some of those too. Um, so I'll share those with her as well, but she's getting her own paper pack. She's gonna be ecstatic, I'm sure. And then, what else did I get? I got a lot. Got a lot. Yeah, I was totally in the clearance section. Um, I was like, did you know that there's 102 pages worth of clearance stuff? <laughs> I was just scrolling and scrolling until I couldn't scroll anymore. I was over it. I was like, this is enough. All right, so these were so fun. Look, the strawberries in the basket. There's some cold drinks, some lemons, my main squeeze. Hello, Summer, you're so cool, so sweet. Fresh pick, just for you. Love you very much. Love this little bicycle. This goes with all the fun things. This is by Simple Stories. Summer Farmhouse is what it's called. There's 19 total stamps. There you go. And I don't remember what I paid for it. Does it on here? Let's see. Nope, the price is not on here, but it wasn't much. I think it was in the clearance because I don't think I looked at anything else. 
Happy holidays. I do need that. So that's going to be great. So you guys go check out scrapbook.com's clearance section. There was tons. Now these were, I don't, didn't know what exactly to expect with these. They say embellishments and I thought, and they're chipboard. Oh, cool. Okay, so these will be fun to layer. These are gonna be fun to layer for anything. Look how sturdy they are. They're chipboard, they're paper. And there's, it's a one set. Is there four in a pack? One, two, three, four in a pack. But what else is cool, I can use these to make an album. I could put a hole through each one of these, put a ring through it, make a flip tag, um, something like that, or just use it to layer stuff up on and add it to maybe a big card or, I'm not sure yet, but I know that I'm gonna find a use for these. I love them, they're cool. I wasn't really sure exactly what to expect, but that's that's what I was exactly what I was hoping for. You know, does anybody else get annoyed at these sticky bags when you're trying to put stuff back in and the and the top just sticks to everything? Oh, so frustrating. All right. So I got two of those. I got some. What is this? Stickers. Stitch sentiments. Hi, hello, much love. Thinking of you with each stitch. Thinking of you with each stitch. I wish I would have gotten another one of these. You are the thread that keeps us together. Each stitch on this card is a hug from me. Oh, that's cute. I wish I'd gotten more of those, but those are fun. Those are fun. Um, let's look at this. Neutral smooth cardstock. This is just a package. <coughs> Excuse me. Five sheets of each color, 40 sheets. These are great. These are going to be great for, for fall. Um, I was also thinking of skin tones. I think this would be beautiful for skin tones for my Julie Nutting dolls, maybe. Or for, um, I have all those kid, um, the kid die cuts, and I just, I, I want something different. So I thought that would be fun to use for. So there's lots of beautiful colors in here. Love that. But that's what my thoughts were there. So that's gonna come in handy. Um, harvest let's see what these are some of the things I wasn't quite sure exactly what I was getting but I thought oh I could use it I'll find a way um, that's kind of my scrapping my scrapping style is I'll find a way to use it whatever it is oh, they're just um, page pieces harvest page pieces so it's paper it's paper. It, it's got a weird um, sheen to it. It looked um, like maybe there was a fabric or something over it, but no, they're paper. That's cool. And there's apples. It looks like it's all layered. A cluster. Some butterflies. These are pretty. Happy fall. I do see, need some fall stuff, so this was going to help me with that. Autumn days are here. Beautiful blue truck. Autumn. Cute, cute, cute. Then we got Simple Stories, Holly Jolly. Those are the pieces on that. Should I take it out? I had fun. I had fun with this stuff. I was trying to get stuff that I knew that I'd use in the in the upcoming holiday season. So I was trying not to just go willy nilly and buy stuff I liked, but stuff for the holidays so that I was prepared. Christmas lights, there's some holly pieces, tiny pieces. I don't know what, I think that's just like a scribble kind of thing, which would be cute with like a sentiment on top, deck the halls, some scraps. Ho, 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 got a ticket. Christmas tree. These will be great for layering. I don't have a lot of stuff like this. I probably do, actually. I probably do. Probably lying to myself right now. <laughs> I don't have any of that. No, give me more. Um, I probably have plenty. So I think after this holiday, as I have to roll, in, roll into next year, 
I think I'm gonna really cut back on my buying, like I said I was gonna do last year, and um, start using up some of this stuff, because I've been collecting sparklets, embellishments. So this is glitter, there's, um, this is cute. There's be small beads in there. There's little, looks like diamond dots. Um, like the tube things like you get at um, Dollar Tree. It looks like there's some of that in there. There's little snowman sequins. How cute, tiny itty bitty beads. That's really cute. That's gonna be fun to use in something. Okay, this is not Christmas, but, 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 I wanted it. <laughs> Let's just be honest. I wanted it, okay, I got it. This is a layered stencil, so I've never had any of these, <clears throat> so I guess you do the leaves there, and then you go back over it and do the flowers, or, yeah, because that will leave it clean and clear. And so when you do the leaves, it'll leave a spot right there. Then you layer this over the top and then you do the flowers over it. So you can use different colors and it'll turn out something like that. Is that cool or what? So I thought that would be fun to play with. I am not. I don't have any layered ones like that. Um, and we can use roses all year, even at Christmas. And we'll put some glitter on them and call them poinsettias. Yeah, that's what we'll do. So there. I don't mind using roses at Christmas. This is another stencil, Harvest Leaves. We all need some Harvest Leaves. And I can just see this with brushed on inks, like blending into each other, uh, greens and orange and yellow and browns. I can just see this so pretty as a background or, oh, I love it. Light chipboard, okay, so here's some more chipboard embellishments. This one, I'm gonna open this one. This one's a little more detailed. I thought, was thinking this might be cute as a gingerbread house. I wonder if they're all detailed like this, like this though. Are they all like that? Or just the one? Okay, so that's what I think they're supposed to be for is like a, um, like a book. I think that's the intention. So here's, this one is the only piece like this, which would be the cover, right? Be the cover for that. And you would attach it, glue it on. And this is where you attach them. And then these are the pages. I think that's what's supposed to happen here. Although I guess I could use them for anything else, but this is super cute. And that's what I was thinking about using for this one, is turning it into a little gingerbread house. So there be fun and then I got some of these is there just one in here oh that's a bummer I thought there were more in this one but this is the um, little sewing hoop and then this is the back so you put your design in there and put the hoop over the top that'll be cute that'll be a great ornament this one Fabulous. So I thought this was a set, and I'm a little bummed because I'm not gonna have use for this unless they're stamps, and I don't think I ordered stamps to go with it. So I got a die set. But no stamps. So it's useless unless I can find the stamps. All right, that's a bummer. I thought it would come with it. I'll have to look and see. Or maybe I surprised myself about the smell, but there's nothing else here. I got no stamps, so, well, we'll figure that out. Okay. Ugh, hate it when I do that. But I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure if it would come with the stamps or not. I kind of assumed it would. This one is also chipboard. But look at these gorgeous flowers. Aren't they pretty? Now I am curious if I could watercolor these and how they would work out. I'm sure there must be some way to, let's see what they suggest. 
can be colored using paint, ink, heat embossing, or by applying waxes and structural paste. This project brings up. Mm -hmm. So I can paint them. Really, really pretty. I'll be looking forward to playing with those. Let's see, I got another, let's get this out of the way. What did I get here? These are pop dots or pops, color pops. This one was the free gift with my order. And I don't have any of these, so I thought it'd be fun to play with and a great color. So there we go. I did get a, a watercolor brush. So you put the water in there, brush marker. Um, I may or may not have one, but I don't remember playing with one. So I don't think I do. And I want to start playing with my watercolors some more again. Favorite. I love this. So this is a die and it says favorite. It's got a line under it. I thought that would be fun for recipes or for cards or for whatever. This one is, what does it say? Good, I see good. This is upside down, I think. Good things, that's what it says. It says good things, super cute. So it's got the border and then it's got the words, which could probably be used separately. I got wood mittens for Christmas. Again, chipboard embellishments. Ooh, these might be shakers or could possibly be used as such. Let's open this one up and see. Yeah, look, these are not connected. Oh, it is a shake. Wait, what? Is it a shaker? It is a shaker, so this is an, okay, look. So if I use the back piece, this is the bigger one, and then I put acetate, take this piece out. Snap it out, I'm gonna do it anyway. This is the shaker. Once I get it done. And then I have an extra piece. So I can use this for layering or something else. Cute. All right, so there's that one. See, I got lots of fun things for the holidays. And since I was at it, I did get some paper because, you know, let's open it up. Let's open it up because I have not seen this paper. This is um, Cozy Christmas by... Renee Looney. Fancypantsdesigns.com. Okay. Let's check these out. Ooh, that looks warm. Cute. They're like sweater prints and wood. Plaid and pine cones. Very nice, these are very different than the ones I have already, the Christmas prints, a little whimsical. I love that. And they'll go nicely together. Very cute, I'm glad I got that. So you guys, that's it for my haul from scrapbook.com. Go check them out, go check out those clearance pages. I'm telling you, there's a ton there. Lots of things you'll find. Watch out for these guys. Make sure if you get the um, the die cut that you get the stamp to go with it. Don't make the same mistake I did. In the meantime, if anybody needs this die cut, because you have the stamp, let me know. Because um, I'm not sure I'll be able to find the stamp. So I hope you all have a fantastic day. I will see you in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.